Hi guys, welcome back to another day in Erin. This is an over five-year-old series where we get to know more about the people within our community. And today, I am here with Nonskiller. Hello. Let's get started with the questions. <laughs> so, how long have you been playing Mabby? I think around 2010. Um, and basically, well, the first thing I started was an elf. But then I just didn't want to be an elf, so I became a human. Mm, yeah. And, and from, yeah. And from there, I was just like, okay, I'm going to call myself non-skiller. And try not to use skills. Oh, is that actually how the... Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I was going to ask about your name, but uh, yeah, you're you're answering that for me right off the bat, so... Mm-hmm. And then I joined... I was trying to find an elf guild to join as a human, but none of the elves would let me in, so... I tried to find, like, a skilled guild called Skilled Guild. Oh, my god. And that's gosh. where I met up with, like, Deletion and other guild members from that guild. Do you want to, like, uh, shout out any names, actually, off the bat? That you... From my memory? Yeah, like, uh, like people that you'll always remember, or... Well, there are some names... Um, I can mention. All I remember is the guild master from Skilled Guild was uh, Deletion. And that was really it, <laughs> to be honest. But there was also another person, but his name was Zerazian. But he found this something later on, which then we created the non Skilled Guild. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then he left the guild, and pretty much I just took over. Yeah, what's the, what's the story about uh, your new guild here? The new guild? Yeah, so I joined the skilled guild, hoping to become an officer. But then in the end, it never happened. So then he... So the guild master uh, kicked me out of the guild. Oh. For, uh... For things I will not mention, but... <laughs> That's all good, it's all good. Yes. And what from there, I basically made my own guild. I was like, oh yeah... Forget the skilled guild. I'm the non-skilled guild. You were. And that was, <laughs> yeah. He was basically quitting the game anyway. So. Would you say it's like kind of like a rebel kind of guild, or? Yeah. <laughs> Rebelling is like yeah, all the skillers. <laughs> oh. It's all about the non-skilled, you know. <laughs> do you actually and use? Do you use skills now, or is it still like you're you're doing everything without skills? I still use. I use skills actually, but. It's. It actually is a lot more quicker to use skills, but. I never use skills, and that's why I have a, a huge uh, loss rate. Because oh. I never use skills. Oh, like, do you PvP a lot? I see. Not or? that I do, but whenever I, like. Whenever sometimes you I do. even leave. Yeah. Sometimes I'll even leave the fight. Or, like, okay. I'm not gonna let this guy um, lose, so I'm gonna go into Homestead or the bank. <laughs> And that's usually what I usually do sometimes. And then, you know, if I did lose, I was like, oh yeah, I won. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Oh, I mean, it's it's sweet that you're <laughs> doing that. <laughs> uh, so uh, what do you think you're known for within the community? Uh, yeah, so... Oh, is this a, is this the, a bad question? It, in the past, <laughs> it, it, it can be a bad question. Now, there could be rumors, but they could be true. Oh, But okay. all, all I'll say is, when I was a young one on Mabinagi, I was looking for a wife. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't think that ever got achieved anyway. But... Oh, okay. I think I got infamous on the game. For looking for a wife? Looking for... <laughs> Yes, looking for a wife. <laughs> I mean, I mean, fair. Yes, and I think that was one of my um, goals, but mm. that kind of went. Uh, I don't even know where that went, but I think I married myself once, and then I unmarried myself, and then I married a few people. And then they unmarried because they want to change their name, and oh yeah, yeah. And then married one person, and then oof. Oh, oh. That, went, that went south. <laughs> that went south there. Oh, so I see. yeah. Um, if, how do you how do you even go about marrying yourself in the game? Is it like is it a glitch or? It's um I just use another computer. When I did it, I use another computer. So, oh, okay. and that's how I did it. Or, 
I actually had someone log into the account. That's how I did that, now I remember. Oh. I had someone log into the account and basically, like, marry me on the game. I think their na the name of that character was something non-something. So it was close, in a way. Yeah, it was... Yeah. Like, just to connect with non-skiller, like, non-skillers, um... No, oh, it was like, no one's wife or something. No, no oh. one's husband or something. Yeah, it's, it's kind of fitting. Kind of fitting. Yeah. <laughs> so it it would work in a way. Yeah. Um. But in terms of that, basically, I went to every single woman on the game in the past. Oh no! Did you harass women? Is that what you did? Yes. Oh. Come on, yes. dude. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> and that's kind of what I did. But for anything else, I usually like to have the idea like, oh yeah, I'm, I'm non-skiller. I'm, uh, I'm awesome. <laughs> you, you don't, that's you fun. don't, you don't do that anymore, though, right? No. No. Okay. Oh yeah, you said um, you you don't really play much anymore. Is I think that's what you said. Yeah, I don't play much anymore. I don't even talk to um a lot of people in the game anymore either. Oh. I just like I lurk. And do commerce. Do you like the new update with commerce? Yeah, I love the the new update with commerce. Are you um, planning on uh, becoming ranked? <laughs> ranked? If I had the time, I would. But I guess not. Um, I I just like how the setup is now, where you could actually go and explore area now. Yeah, it was definitely a really really much needed uh, update for area since it's you know such a big area and like didn't have much in it I guess or it did right. but it was mostly all outdated mm -hmm. but yeah I think it's a good update too I agree mm -hmm. so do you have any favorite NPCs NPCs I usually usually use um, dress up as tin so oh okay but these days like with new outfits and all that I'm just trying to find out a new style but usually um, when I was in the guild, my guild was more active. It was, um, I would wear a tin outfit, gold helmet and all that with the robe. But in terms of another character, there was, I think there's a recent one that came out. It's the new quest. I mean, not new quest, the new dungeon that came out or something. Oh, the fa Fami's Ruins? Or? Yeah. Whoever that guy was, he's pretty cool. I, I've never oh. actually seen him before myself, but... Yeah. He has a nice outfit. Um, and then there's... Uh, I forget his name. But he was from the other quest. I'm getting memory loss. <laughs> oh, it's all, it's all good. I mean, you've you've stated one of them, so... <laughs> it's all that yeah. matters. Uh, just remember, there's another guy. <laughs> there's another guy. I get to kill him. <laughs> you, oh, oh. You love him, but you want to kill him. I see. Yeah. <laughs> That's what happened. Oh, it's, so it's kind of like a non-hate relationship with that NPC then? Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> uh, so do you have a favorite talent? Talent skill would be the hidden talent. Ooh, interesting. Yeah, because that's like the closest thing to non-skilled. Oh yeah, I guess it is, isn't it? Yeah, and then second to that would be Crusader, but... You know what I was going to say? I was going to say <laughs> the... The one that's actually even closer would be the unlearned tab. The unlearned? <laughs> yes, it would. It would, uh, actually. <laughs> but yes, but, the uh, hidden is, is a good one as well. Mm -hmm. So, what do you do in real life? Like, job-wise? Right. So, I'm slowly trying to transition to more of a, a full-time, part-time job in the future. But right now, um, right now I just do like self-employed things, travel um, in my state, just doing Ooh. video stuff. Um, that's really all I do. I've been doing that for since like I would say half a decade or more. Okay. But it's getting to a point where I want to transition to more of a teaching role now. Oh, teaching! Like what? What kind of teaching? Would you just, like to do anyway? Just video, uh, video stuff, video production, and more into the in depth of like the philosophy of like editing and different like styles and how how you could use it in the real world. 
Yeah. That's kind of where I want to approach it to. So. That makes sense. That that sounds that that sounds pretty fun to do and pretty fun to teach. Mhm. Do you still have your very first pet on Mabby? Called Rip Me. Yes, but that's uh that was a trial pet. Yes. <laughs> a trial pet. <laughs> yes, back in the day um your first pet would be like you know I don't know what this pet is. Like I have it, but I don't remember how I got it. But it was one of those trial pets that you get, where it's like 30 days, and then that was it. It was like a horse. But my official, my official actual first pet, I would say, would be a a black flame mare. Oh wow! Okay. Those are. One, I mean, I remember when those came out. They did like a a little contest of uh, like what what to name them. Mm-hmm. I don't know, just a random memory. <laughs> but yeah, those are really cool. I remember them being like the most popular pet at the time and like everybody got one. So it's it kind of fitting. Like, yeah. Where before where you could change the color. Yeah, exactly. You know? Yeah, didn't yeah. they make that a thing after? Like or was it I don't remember anymore. Yeah, they never had the co- the color change yet until way way later because because now you could just color all your black flare mares that you have. Yeah. It makes it a lot more better. Hmm, okay. But I don't know if they're, like, the best pet now. Yeah, no, I, I don't think so either. <laughs> I think I think we've we've gone way past that at this point. Yeah. Well, yeah, what do you think about the Finny stuff? I, I Like, for me personally, I kind of feel like it was kind of useless, but... Uh... <laughs> it's... It has its uses, but it it does help expand the uh, the pet. But I feel like maybe the minutes need to be doubled for the pets. Mm. Because you know, if you have like a pet with only what's the lowest amount a pet can have. So my lowest is like eighty-seven minutes on one pet. Yeah. So in theory, like, if that was your main pet that you wanted to use could be like the worst pet for a finny but it's like it's not worth it yeah i gotcha yeah but most pets that i have now are like 180 minutes and 120 so yeah it works yeah it does so do you have any advice that you would like to give people whether it be in real advice or in game advice or both Mm. I would say, hmm, buy a house. <laughs> buy, buy a house. That, I mean, yes. that's good advice, good advice. Buy a house on Mabinagi. Oh. And, then, and I'm talking about one of those residential houses. Yeah, like the housing channel? Yeah. Those are definitely better houses for sure, um, in my opinion, of a homestead. Uh, but then again, uh, the homestead stuff has a lot more stuff now these days. So that is true. Yeah, but I, I kind of like... miss. I kind of miss the housing channel. Yeah, I like the housing channel because like you could decorate the way you want. Yeah. And it's like it's not as complicated as the homestead one. Where at? But I don't know if they updated the the camera setup in there, or oh. you can rotate it like the other place. This is where the homestead one get really gets the points. Yeah. Right? Because you have multiple rooms. Kind of defeats the purpose of the house and channel. Yeah, that's true. But the difference is the house and channel, you live in a neighborhood. Who doesn't want to live in a neighborhood? You gotta live in the Mabinogi suburbs. and. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why not, right? Have the little suburban life that you mm-hmm. have always wanted. Oh, and I would, I would always have that one house right in front of the the gateway of Sen Mag. Oh, not you would you didn't choose like the middle? No, I just wanted the one in the front. I because... remember always wanting like the ones that were at like the middle, like the center. I just like, yeah, I just like the one at the front because it was right next to like another house across of it, which was like the sample house, I think. Oh yeah. I wonder why they had a sample house. Now I'm thinking about it now. Like, kind of seems a little unnecessary, but 
I mean, I guess back in the day, something like that was still kind of new-ish. So maybe it was just to show an example. I mean, that's what a sample is, but... <laughs> yeah. Nowadays it just seems unnecessary, but... Yeah. Maybe they'll do an update for the housing in uh, the residential. I feel like they have to at this point because it's unused content almost. And with the, yeah, with the auction house, they kind of killed the housing channel. Maybe... Oh, I was gonna say maybe like... I, I was thinking about how the homesteads should have been something similar to the housing channel where you could set stuff for sale in your homestead house and then you could like teleport to people's homesteads and check the stuff out but at the same time then again that would once again be another reason not to have the housing channel it would be even right. more unused than it already is but i don't know maybe they, they could do something i'm not sure what it'd be yeah. nice to see though so ideally if i was to um talk about my ideas when when, when i made the guild there's some expansion to it um I always wanted a, a the Sigman the Sigman castle, but for some reason, like someone always like buys it. I was like, I want that at castle, <laughs> you know. And they always pay a lot for it. Yeah. Yeah, I noticed that. I think I I looked into that one time because I was so curious about it, and yeah, I was like, uh, back when ten mil was a lot, I'm pretty sure someone always offered ten mil for the castles, and I'm like, what? Like how how how's anyone supposed to beat that? <laughs> Because it was like, was like was it, what is it, like every week or is it like every month-ish that it kind of resets? I think every month or so. And then if you, and then you don't have to rebuild it if you keep it up. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. And I really, yeah, and I was like, oh, I had all the assets, like all the the, the materials to make the house. Oh I yeah, the I forgot castle. there were materials too. I was like, oh, I'm going to totally get this castle. <laughs> I got all the guild members to, <laughs> to collect the assets, the materials, and then they give it to me and I put it like in a horse. Oh. And be like, okay. Like, we got it, guys. We got the castle. No, we didn't get the castle. <laughs> oh. Have you ever gotten the castle? Nope. Damn. One day, maybe. <laughs> one, one day. <laughs> you m Maybe you have a better chance these days. Who knows? I haven't, I haven't checked to see if, like, it's still expensive or not. Because, like... If I had the castle, I don't even know how many houses are in Sin Mag, but, you know, fanatically, like, I really would want to have all the guild members to have a house. Aww. <laughs> yeah. That's it'll cute. Be, it'll be cool. Yeah. So, uh... It'll be like... Oh, sorry. Uh, it would be like the non-skilled guild had their own, like, city. <laughs> The city of non-skilled. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, Skilled Guild actually owned Sin Mag long ago. Oh, so is, is this another part of... of uh... Yeah. <laughs> so. There's a, a battle between me and the guild leader. It's oh, like, I boy. want guild officer. Because, <laughs> you know, we finally got the castle for once. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Well, <laughs> maybe one day. Maybe got... one day. Yeah, then I got kicked out of the guild. <laughs> yeah. And, and now now you have your own. Yeah. So, uh, thank you for doing this with me. It was uh, no really problem. interesting getting to know you. Mm hmm Since I've, I, I've heard your name around, but didn't really, like, know anything at all about you. <laughs> like, like yeah. people would bring up your name and I'd be like, oh, who's, who's this non-skilled guy? Like, <laughs> it was like a mystery. Sure. It's a mystery, a blend of rumors and probably half truths. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I feel like that's that's everyone nowadays. Everyone has like yeah. rumors and stuff about them. If you've been playing for a while, it's just kind of what happens. But mm -hmm. um, but yeah. So it was really nice talking to you. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, I will see everybody in Aaron another day. Goodbye. <laughs>